How's it going everyone? I'm not gonna lie, I was low-key kind of nervous for this day because here's the thing, right? I've done every single matchmaking required like achievement now. It's they're all they're all done, all of them, including all the DLC, all of that is done. Except for the weekly challenge. I have not done the weekly challenges yet. So that's my final achievement I need to do for matchmaking. And I was kind of worried that, you know, it, the last one would either be impossible or, or it's like a complete nightmare. Because if it was, then that means I had like no chance of ever 100%ing Halo Reach. Good news is though, it's not that hard. Play four sets on any firefight map and co-op play on heroic or harder. Basically, you just need to finish a long firefight game and then that's it. You're like kind of done. Which, I mean, thank goodness, dude. <laughs> I was so worried. I'm not gonna lie, I was low-key a little overly negative yesterday on the Splitgate video. So if you came here from that, waiting to just hate on me for being like a Halo fanboy, I just wanna say, I really like Splitgate. I just thought it'd be funny if I like got mad at it at the end. So yeah, Splitgate, solid game. Good job, guys. Just one, make a hit video. <laughs> and it actually worked out. Maybe it actually did really well, which thank you guys for that. If you're enjoying the content I'm making, please subscribe. It means a lot. I'm 18 subs away from 200. I've been doing this shit for like seven years. <laughs> please help me. Uh, so I guess we're here on Sword Base. Easily a top tier Halo map, honestly. Only last time it was two people. Revenge. Nice. Die the leader. Yeah, when whenever I queue for a uh, reach on in the mornings, it always just happens to be the most uneven and weird games. You know what I, I wish I didn't remove? I literally just remember this. The, um... Back in the day, in like the little, like, you know, the card thing, right? I'm gonna pop up a card right there in the top right. Boom. Uh, in there, you, you used to be able to do polls and stuff. You know, like, questions. I know they have that in the community town now, but I don't have 1,000 subscribers. So I can't really do a poll. But they used to be able to integrate that, like, straight into videos. And I wish I still did that, man. I, I missed that feature. Uh, I'm just gonna... <laughs> Wait, who's streaming? Yo. Yeah, this dude behind us is gonna take care of him. Yep. Yeah, it's not going too well for this guy. I wonder what. I wonder if he's gonna back out. Actually, I genuinely wonder why. Like so many console games, like basically every console game, use peer-to-peer -peer instead of dedicated servers. I mean, surely they don't cost that much, right? Especially for like a massive game company. They can like afford a dedicated server, program it in. Have people connect that way. They don't, they don't need peer-to-peer. -peer. I don't know, it's just kind of lame. I mean, at least it means you can still play Halo 3 custom games. You even have to shut down. It's gonna be really weird to see this kind of state these games are in when they shut down the servers. Especially considering how like connected they're basically made to be. I don't know, it's gonna be very interesting. Dude, I've like only killed that guy using the energy sword. This is so weird. Well, maybe he will learn his lesson this time and not walk straight into my energy sword. Yeah, he did. Okay, yeah, congratulations. Watch now, he's gonna troll. What the? F I said it, I said I knew it, dude. I called it. He immediately dies with it, dude. Okay, this, I, if I was him right now at the situation, I wouldn't care. I'd just back out, like, immediately. I, I'd be done with this game. Imagine being someone who has like, <laughs> has like no idea any of the Halo games are shutting down, so you're just like casually playing Halo 3, and then just notice there's like 50,000 people online. I generally wonder how many of the people who are like actively playing Halo 3 to this day, actually know that it's shutting down. Cause I'm like, sure some, some of those people aren't just playing for the novelty and actually just don't have internet access, right? No- Oh! Holy shit, the lag saved me. That was insane. I should not have won that. I'm, I'm so sorry. How's he still not backed out? That's actually impressive. I'm, I'm going to keep it a stack. Is he going to come back out? No, I think he's just going to run straight into my energy sword. Or not. Oh, I did not see that guy, dude. What is this FOV? <laughs> I know it sounds like a total bitch baby 10 year old like, Halo nerd, Halo noob saying that, but I mean, it, it, it's definitely kind of rough once you played MCC in Infinite. 
Also, I'm happy to say, so far from my like daily upload schedule, which I mean, I I, I really started like first of this year. I don't think I've had like a single super major like recording issue. Every time it's went smoothly. Like one time I had audio issues, right? There's nothing I can do about that, and it's like. The video is still kind of watchable. I mean, you can't really hear me that well. I mean, like, aside from that, though, there's been no crashes, no, like, complete freezes, no desync. It's going well so far. I still don't get why, like, there's that weird bug where it's, like, randomly get disconnected and, like, thrown into your own lobby. Now I think about it, I might be just thinking about Halo 3. Because that, that's where I had that issue the most. Like, I'd be going for, like, forever, and then I'd finally find a game, but it's literally just me, and it ends immediately. I get, like, nothing for it. Revenge. It's always so stupid. I'm really low right now. Oh my, oh my shit. Okay, I want to ask you guys something real quick. What do you guys think is, like, the worst Halo map of all time? Like, I'm talking, like, from the good games. Like, all the Bungie games, and, I guess, Halo Infinite. Out of all of them, what is the absolute worst map? in halo history all right leave it in the comments i need i need to see this i'm not gonna lie i don't have like a concrete answer but in halo infinite i fucking hate playing on behemoth it's such an awful map and i hate it like a lot i don't know leave it in the comments let me know what you think thank you for